Did you know that today is Friendship Day? So what you should do, text your friend, let them know you care. Hearts for them, all the friends I've got. But first, you should watch this story from photojournalist Mike Kirsten about friendship, which has stood the test of time. Today's National Friendship Day, and um, we're kind of spotlighting uh, a friendship between two residents we have here at Brookdale and Bowling Green, Harold and Rita. Harold's been here since November, and when he moved in, they kind of knew of each other. When I first got here, I was walking around, and I seen your name on the door there. I know them people, <laughs> barely got to know them. He built a puzzle, and I thought, gosh, how cool is that, you know? And then I met him, and we have enjoyed putting pictures, or putting puzzles together. Mm -hmm. uh, Reed and I just started together, I don't know how, just sitting side to side and putting puzzles together, and uh, we got acquainted more that way. And I'm, not, I'm not a big talker, my voice is bad, my hearing is bad, so I don't do a whole lot of talking more than I have to. I, I kind of avoid people for that reason. You feel you don't fit in, so I kind of, isolate myself, except with her. <laughs> well, he's a nice, kind man. He listens, and I listen. She shares about their deep conversations and how they um, remember. They have so many memories separately, and now they're making memories together. It's nice to have a lot of friends, but it's also nice to have a special one. 